Welcome everybody. This week we're doing a sandwich showdown. <laughs> Deli sandwiches from <laughs> Nick Casper's, Divrienzo, and Sherwood, Sherwood Market. So mm -hmm. what we want to do is test out which one we prefer. Mm -hmm. Not like any of them are really bad or anything. It's wh mm -hmm. which one we, we prefer between the three of them. Yeah. We'll start off with where we went first. Uh, Nicastro's. They're all over Ottawa. This one we got from the Glebe area. There's mm -hmm. another one in Little Italy and there's another one on oh, Wellington. Maribel. That's right, yeah. And then there's another one that's like La Bottega on, in the market. Mm -hmm. Comment below if they're, they're any different from one another yeah. because we got a little confused about the whole thing. I, I feel like they are. Yeah. <laughs> I feel they're all the same. It's like the name and then yeah. Nicastro's or Nicastro's right. and then the name. So. And unfortunately <clears throat> Frank's Deli was closed. We wanted to do Frank's Deli as well with this, yeah. but uh, they were closed on Sundays. Mm -hmm. So Nicastro's Italian Damn. combo. Yeah, spicy Italian, Italian combo. combo. All right, cheers. Cheers, guys. guys. Cheers. That mustard is strong. Yeah. I like it though. It's not like your standard mustard, you know? Mm -hmm. There's certain mustards that just work better with sandwiches. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't find it that strong, the mustard. It's just the spiciness to it. <laughs> uh, the bread seems to have like a nice, uh, it's very hearty <laughs> bread. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I taste mostly bread though. <laughs> <laughs> I taste the saltiness of the meat. Yeah. And I don't, I feel like I don't taste the cheese as much. Well, it is a small slice of yeah. cheese there. Mm -hmm. And then you have that <laughs> nice thin bite of lettuce. Mm -hmm. We should have put spicy eggplant on this one. Yeah. No, Brian mentioned I did that ask, he forgot. I did ask for it to be spicy, but mm -hmm. it wasn't, I didn't ask for the eggplant. Mm -hmm. Probably, I don't, this is a pretty good sandwich. Is mm -hmm. it like, I feel like you can't go wrong mm -hmm. with a deli sandwich. Like a no. deli sandwich. It's it's not your subway. It's like <laughs> no, no. yeah, your bread would have to yeah. be trash. Like yeah, it's not trash. The, but no, no. In no. order for it to be bad, like to mess it to up. Yeah, yeah. Like somehow the bread would have to be bad. The meat would have to be mm -hmm. bad. Which this is not. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> so I was like, uh, uh, I'm about to finish this. It is really good. I think for me, I would have liked some hot peppers on it. But mm. like we we're going like very basic. Mm -hmm. with our sandwiches yeah. this time around. We all kind of follow the same kind yeah. of the same choice rubric, of meat, yeah. choice of meat, toppings. Because we wanted to make it fair for, for each of them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The second one we're going to do is uh, De Rienzo's. <clears throat> now De Rienzo's is probably one of the most famous ones of the, the three Ottawa, of them. Yeah. I'm yeah. excited. Do you guys find that there's more meat in this one than the other one? I think it's about the same. Actually, maybe one more layer more. Yeah, yeah it's a slightly a little more. Yeah. But it also could be the type of meat yeah. that's yeah. used as well. And this one, you added the eggplant though. The I did add eggplant. eggplant. Yeah. Yeah. That's a little added advantage for the yeah. durians. Yeah, one. <laughs> give you that little extra bite. Sorry, Nicastro, I forgot to <laughs> ask for the eggplant. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right, cheers, cheers guys. guys. Cheers. It's so nice to have this after such a long time. Mm -hmm. I haven't had it in years. Yeah, same. I can't remember the last time I had them. Yeah. It's that bread. Mm -hmm. That bread, that bread, that bread. I like this one a lot. I can't say I'm a fan of the eggplant though. What? <laughs> no. no. I like the rest of the sandwich though. Pickled it's eggplant. It's the pickled eggplant um, aftertaste to it. Mm. But I do like the spice that it adds to it. Mm -hmm. I think the bread definitely adds to it. <clears throat> and although all the places have, you know, they're named, like the cuts of meat are the same. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's a different supplier, maybe it's a different oh, true. kind, right? So There's also more oil to this one. Because when I was... Yeah, when you digging, were unwrapping it. Was, uh, when I was unwrapping it, my hands were filled with oil afterwards. Mm -hmm. yeah, and then you that could be a adding the extra flavor to it. Then maybe some... The eggplant. From the spiced eggplant, yeah. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I would order it without the eggplant for next time, though. You want me to flip this table? <laughs> <laughs> next episode, Brian will be here. <laughs> There's no table! Okay. Now we have Sherwood Deli. Uh, Sherwood Deli, I didn't even realize that it was even mm -hmm. a place. Um, we, it's like just off of Carling. Mm -hmm. It's uh, in into Sherwood, which is a, like a little back street into, from that hill that goes down from Carling. Yeah, yeah. yeah. This is the egg bread from Sherwood Deli. Sherwood Market Deli. Cheers, guys. Cheers. Cheers. Mm -mm. 
I taste the cheese much stronger in this one. I think it's because of the texture of the bread helps it because mm. it's soft. I am pleasantly surprised. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then they have their own special sauce, right? The Sherwood sauce. Yeah. Yeah. Yo, this is good. Uh-huh. <laughs> it is very good. He's like, but I see you Watch when you get the chicken avocado, though. Yeah, I really want to oh, try yeah. that one. Yeah. Was the eggplant added to this one as well? Yeah. You better believe it. <clears throat> yeah. I like it in this one better than the <laughs> one that did Rienzo. I think it's that sauce that helps with it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, big time. Yeah, whatever that sauce is, it's delicious. Yeah. You'd mentioned earlier that uh, you didn't think they put, they put as much meat on this one, but looking inside, it's kind of be around the same amount. Mm. It's very good. The meats and even the cheese taste good with it. Mm -hmm. but, that, but that's the thing, right? Like you could get the other breads. Yeah. But from going to Sherwood Market in the past, <clears throat> I felt that I never wanted to get any other bread other mm -hmm. than the egg bread. Overall, all great sandwiches. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But if you were to choose one of the three, which one would you choose? I would choose Sherwood. Really? Yeah. Sherwood. And Sherwood just because of the bread, right? You like the bread and the sauce? The bread, the sauce, and everything inside it. Uh, I feel I'm almost biased because I, I love Sherwood. <laughs> but then it's like, the fact that I haven't had Dirienzo's in a while mm -hmm. and having that like signature bun or bread that they have, just like the texture of the bread and the deli and everything inside, mm -hmm. it was like reminiscent. I was like, oh. Mm. <laughs> right? So yeah. it's between Sherwood and Dirienzo's. Yeah. I can't decide. Really? Yeah. Yeah, Sherwood and Dirienzo's is really close. I would actually choose Dirienzo just like at a tiny bit above just because I love the bread a little. A little mm -hmm. more, yeah, and I can just imagine with, without the spicy <laughs> eggplant. Without the spicy eggplant? Yeah, it's not oh, that yeah. bad. It's not. Totally... <clears throat> yeah, it's not. It's not bad. Like it's it, not just not for cool. everybody. Mm -hmm. So thank you everybody for showing up, uh, watching the videos. Um, until next time, we'll see you guys. Bye. <laughs>